Hello, 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 hello. A new problem. We're going back to the days of the shuttle. The shuttle is in a circular orbit around the Earth. The total mass of the shuttle, which includes also the fuel of the rocket, which is part of the shuttle, which can be used to change the orbit of the shuttle, all that included has a mass of 10 to the 5 grams, 100,000 kilograms. The speed of the shuttle is 8.0 kilometers per second. They fire the rocket in such a way that the speed, which is 8.0 kilometers per second, say in this direction, remains in the same direction but becomes 8.5 kilometers per second. It's a very short burn. The exhaust gas speed relative to the shuttle. So that gas is coming out of, that hot gas is coming out of the rocket, of course. The speed of that gas exhaust relative to the rocket is 2.5 kilometers per second. And the question is, how much fuel does it take? What is the mass of the fuel to make that happen? This, of course, requires a reasonable understanding on how rockets work. And I refer you to lecture number 17 of 801. I derived there the rocket equations. And if you follow that, there's no question you can do this problem very, very easily. Okay. Have a nice day. Take care. And surely, we will remain <laughs> friends that goes without saying. <laughs>